what do you make of the fact that um, the other parties are trolling the one district, one factory, and then one village, one dam policy? Well, Gomia has said it all. Leadership is about choices. Mahama is doing one chief, one land cruiser, one chief, one land cruiser. The cost of the land cruiser is they can build a dam in the village. So he chooses to use that money for only one person. And we say, when we come, the monies that are lying wherever he's getting it to buy land cruiser per chief, we will use that money and build a dam in the village. And with that dam, the people, the whole village will get to do their agricultural activities over 12 months. Then they will get money, including the chief, who will then get money and buy his own land cruiser. I, I follow me. So that he becomes a full human being. For me, giving land cruisers to our chiefs is demeaning. It's an insult to the chiefs. We want chiefs who have their own capacity, who can work on their own and earn an income and buy their cars, so that our chiefs can look at bad governments and bad presidents and tell them the truth. Why, well, you think that if a president gives a chief a land cruiser and the president is running the country, that that chief has the audacity to tell the president the truth? Exactly. So that is what President Mahama is doing. The opinion leaders, the big people in our country who can speak truth to power, who can tell him the truth, he bribes them with land cruises. We will not bribe them. We will give it, we will put it in the village so that they can tell us the truth if we go wrong. That's how to run a country. My father used to tell me that, look, my son, if you reach a certain stage in life and there is nobody who can look you in the eye and tell you the truth, you are doomed. And that is where our country has got into. We need to rescue this country. Wallahi. And I feel very terrible as a Ghanaian at this time. But there is hope, inshallah. God is not asleep.